Hydrochloric acid is an organic acid that's produced in the stomach in the first phase of digestion. And it's utilized to primarily break down proteins and fats and turn them into molecules that can then pass into the small intestine for further digestion. Hydrochloric acid is produced in our bodies through the initial phase of digestion, which is called the cephalic phase. Basically, the cephalic phase is when we first come into sight and smell of our food. This initiates the parietal cells to start to stimulate enzymes and gastric juices, including hydrochloric acid. The benefits of hydrochloric acid are very important and vital to our ability to break down all foods. Hydrochloric acid also is important for our immune system. So it's our first line of defense for the immune system. As it comes into contact with food, the microorganisms that naturally occur in the food then come in contact with the hydrochloric acid. The hydrochloric acid helps to sanitize the food. So it's essential for the first part of our digestive system to start to break down and assimilate food into nutrients and it also is our immune system first line of defense against microorganisms. Symptoms uh, that are associated with not producing enough hydrochloric acid or being hypochlorhydric are very diverse and overlapping. Some of the most easy to tell symptoms are going to have to do with how your body feels after eating, meaning are you getting bloated or are you getting gassy, do you feel indigestion uh, in general. Those are some of the first symptoms of a lack of hydrochloric acid, although there are many other sub-symptoms that can be manifested uh, throughout the body. Hydrochloric acid production can be inhibited through having excessive amounts of stress. Stress is dominant to fight or flight, which is counter to parasympathetic dominance, which is mainly for tissue regeneration and food assimilation. Being in a state of chronic stress is counter to being in a state of parasympathetic dominance. Uh, to digest food properly and assimilate the nutrients properly, the body must be in a more parasympathetic state. So how to help rehab the natural production of hydrochloric acid is to kind of look at the opposite end, where now you're trying to be in a more relaxed state. The role of supplementation in the process of rehabbing digestive function, and specifically hydrochloric acid, is important and practical, meaning supplementation can help the body re-stimulate its natural processes. Two supplements that I have used and like to use with good results are going to be Swedish bitters. Um, anything bitter in the mouth, lemon, even apple cider vinegar, these things help stimulate the parietal cells to help stimulate hydrochloric acid and pepsinogen production in the stomach. Also, hydrochloric acid supplementation directly with is another way that you can help your body break down food as now you're bringing in acids through supplements directly to break down food while you initiate the repair process of naturally stimulating your hydrochloric acid production.